Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. I hope you're doing well this morning. Let's tap right in, shall we? See what messages Spirit has for us this morning. Eight of Swords in the upright. Somebody's having negative thoughts, feeling restricted, challenged by. Negotiations, balancing decisions, <clears throat> weighing their options. In the subconscious. Four of Cups. They're reevaluating. They're restricted and they're in a Two of Pentacles and a Four of Cups energy. In the recent past, Ace of Wands, Willpower, Potential Beginnings, New Opportunities. The time to act is now. You need action to grow. You can't think about it all day long and expect something to happen. You got to do. Intention and expectation. <clears throat> Moving on to calmer waters. Leaving the baggage behind in the near future. Page of Wands, excitement, free spirit, freedom. The lens is being looked through. The star, spiritual fortune. Healing and renewal. Everybody wants that. I know I do. In the environment. Okay, you don't. In the environment. Four of Wands. Again. Freedom. Free, free, free. Reunions, celebrations. Hopes and fears, hopes and fears, conflict, somebody, there's always somebody who wants to fight. I don't know that there will ever be a situation where there is not somebody present who wants to fight. And the outcome, lovers, the strength of two together. Queen of Cups. Compassion, nurturing. Oh, let's pull these ones today. Let's utilize these ones. Collective energy, please, Spirit. Collective energy. Collective energy, please, Spirit. Collective energy. things. Somebody's restricted regarding things. They're having negative thoughts regarding things. Having victim mentality regarding things. They're feeling isolated and restricted. Did they lose their things? They're challenged by uh, negotiations, balancing decisions. Weighing their options.
body, body. They're challenged by their body. Something is going on with their body. They've been disconnected. They're receiving an offer, but they um, aren't interested in that particular offer. They're restless. They didn't get a spiritual throne. In the recent past, we've got the Ace of Wands, willpower, desire, potential beginnings, new opportunities. This isn't horseplay. This isn't a child's game. We're leaving behind that baggage, moving on to calmer waters, and this relationship is ending. This wise guy did not get his leadership role. There is excitement and freedom here. Ideas, discovery. Conscientious. Thinking about it very carefully, cleaning up all the, sweeping up all the debris, exploring, discovering. We got the star here, um, rejuvenation, renewal, spiritual fortune, faith. Faith. Somebody's not at peace. We've got the Four of Wands here. Celebration, reunion, prophecy. The fear is that there will be um, petty egos clashing still. Bringing drama to other people's lives. Those who are unsatisfied with their own. Important. And we got the lovers on the outcome. The strength of two together. And a remembrance of a bloodline of a particular child. And the hardship they went through that they handled with perfection just by being themselves. Just by being you, you handled all this garbage that they thought would bury you. These, these ancestors, these actors. These ancestors that were just pretending to be whoever they thought they were. And now congratulations on the vanity. Those who are vain are being haunted. Those who labored against those who self-cared. Congratulations, you're now being haunted. You came up against the arcana. The actual teacher. You actually martyred the actual teacher. <laughs> Stupid mofo. Stupid. <laughs>
gosh. <laughs> Collective energy, please. <laughs> Pathway. Somebody's feeling restricted regarding things and a pathway. They don't get things. They don't get this pathway. They're challenged over weighing their options regarding a body. They're in poverty. They could be sick. They're disconnected with the Four of Cups. They need to reevaluate. Um, they did not get the spiritual throne. <laughs> Message of concern. Ace of Wands, this is not horseplay. This is about willpower. This is about desire. This is about potential beginnings. This is about new opportunities. We got a thief here. <clears throat> He's not able to horseplay around with this. <clears throat> this is not about horseplay. This has nothing to do with horseplay. This community is under adjudication. <laughs> oh my gosh. So this relationship is ending. The wise guy did not get a leadership role. The house. Relationships ending, you're releasing the baggage, you're moving on to calmer waters, you're leaving behind all this crap and you're going home. You're a conscientious person, you, this is about excitement and freedom, you're a free spirit, this is limitless potential. Conscientious, limitless potential, free spirit. We have a main male <clears throat> who is a wealthy man coming into unexpected income. <clears throat> we have a star here and there's no peace. This is a lens that's being looked through. So there's a star who perhaps... Um, didn't have any peace. Somebody's in bad health. Somebody's in bad health. They didn't get what they were expecting. <coughs> They're not having any peace regarding this star, regarding hope, regard, regarding a spiritual fortune, regarding um, renewal and rejuvenation. They didn't get what they were expecting. They're not at peace 
regarding this star. Um, we've got a four of wands here, a freedom, marriage, reunion, celebration, harmony, and it was prophesied. Mature man. Hanging out in the hopes of <clears throat> bringing competition to people who are important. Competition and conflict <clears throat> to people who are important, who have a gift, who are a gift. Yeah, this mature man still wants to bring conflict. He's an a-hole who just, that's all he's good for. He has nothing else to offer the world except conflict. That's it. There's nothing valuable there. The only value that that is, is um, an opportunity for others to use that resistance <clears throat> for their own benefit, to transmute that resistance for their own gain. That's the only good it's for. And that, yeah, that's up to the choice of the individual receiving the conflicting, uh, uh, conflicted energies and such. You know, if you're willing to transmute it, then you can use it for your benefit. But if you're not able to or don't want to, then it's going to affect you in a negative way. And they know this. So we got the lovers here. There's a child that's being remembered uh, or a bloodline. Main female occupation. Main female may be getting a new job. Maybe she's doing uh, work right now. Child, she could be seen as innocent. And this person's ability to get it, tap into her thoughts is in the is in the grave, in the coffin. This jack wagon can't mess with her head anymore. Oh, she's um, lovers or coming into a love relationship with an official person. Maybe she's seen as an official person getting a new job. And that um, that leaves this mature man. He's in despair. He's in despair over this great fortune. He's very concerned about it. He's very concerned about this courtship that this main female is coming into. And this main male is right here. A wealthy man. A conscientious wealthy man. Collective energy, please, spirit. Collective energy. Collective energy, please, spirit. Collective energy. Collective energy, please, spirit. Collective energy. Gossip. Guilty. Gossip guilty. They're, they're in prison. Somebody's imprisoned because they were going after the things belonging to somebody else's pathway. People are gossiping about it. They're guilty. They're, they're restricted. They're bound. They're challenged because they're challenged by the, a body, their body, they're in poverty. So their body may be like low energy, low health, low vitality. They have to weigh their options. They have to make some decisions. Um, they're, they're being challenged by their body. They're in poverty. And they're mentally restricted. They're in a victim mentality mode. They're feeling broken. They're feeling shattered. They've been disconnected. They did not get the spiritual throne. They've got a message of concern. They're feeling restless. 
They're reevaluating. They neglected. They they neglected uh, to give what was needed. They made mistakes. They want to mend a connection. No, there's you. you no, you. There was extreme neglect and they made a lot of mistakes and now they're like, oh, Ken, let's mend this connection so what? So they can get another shot at trying to steal this spiritual throne. They're seen for, for what they for what they did, and there's no they, they want to mend the connection. Of course they do. <clears throat> we got an ace of wands here. <clears throat> Excuse me. There's no more horse playing around. Okay, the Ace of Wands is here. This community is under adjudication. Ace of Wands is being wielded. Oh, for all of you, somebody mentioned they needed some of this the other day. This is what that is, just in case you want to look, look for that. The finger sticky. It's good stuff. So this community is under adjudication. They can't horseplay around anymore. Their values were all about money. And they can't um, call up or, or get in touch with um, somebody and have a conversation. Like there's no, there's no communication. Like there's a no contact order <clears throat> from the courts. You're moving on to calmer waters. The relationship with this scenario is ending. You're moving into a house. This wise guy did not gain your leadership role or a leadership role that belongs to somebody else. They were not able to gain that. There's this main, this main male here. So this wise guy was not able to steal the spiritual throne or pathway of this main male. He feels there's unfinished business, of course. I didn't win. Of course, there's unfinished business. I can't stop until I win. Right? So you've got this main male here. He's very conscientious. He's a wealthy man. He's coming into unexpected income. He's an inspiration to people. He's got um, inspiring ideas, limitless potential. He's a free spirit. He's free. He's got his freedom. Somebody's disagreeing about this. This wise guy is disagreeing. He's like, he doesn't think this conscientious main male should be free. <laughs> He's, he thinks you need to understand how he feels. It's like, no, don't, don't, don't congratulate this main male. Think about me. I need attention. So he didn't get what he was looking for. He's not at peace. He didn't get what he was expecting. He's in bad health. He needs this star energy which is um, this main male, he's coming into unexpected income or he, he has an unexpected income, like maybe whatever things he had to overcome, um, he's like blinging, bling. That's his unexpected income, this vitality that has grown inside of him. And there's hope, for, oh, he hasn't given up on us yet. Or um, that's what it says on the card. And it says, new chapter. This main male wants, wants to be with this star. He wants rejuvenation and healing with this. Um, and, and, a, and, a, and a life of four of wands with this star. It was prophesied. You've got this mature man, though, lurking in the environment. Lurker. He's a lurker. He's lurking. He's lurking around people who love themselves and are still healing. He's a lurker. Yeah, he's lurking. He's like one of those weird lurkers. And he's wanting to bring conflict to people who are important. Who are a gift. Who have a gift. He's unworthy. And that he's in the environment right now with the hope that he can bring conflict to important people and their gift. <clears throat> to 
to people who love themselves. He's wanting to F up this prophecy, this future, this new cycle for these lovers, these new love unions, these um, devoted partnerships. time it's too late to take any action he wants to that's his hope but it's too late to take any action too late to take any action dude you've got the lovers here the strength of two together there is a child being remembered or a family line uh being remembered and this main female is getting a new occupation truth is revealed the truth is revealed that mature man is unworthy he's running he's a third party he's a third party mofo and he's running he's unworthy And you're coming into a union of reciprocity. Twenty seven minutes. We got two, at least two more passes, maybe three. We'll see. Collective energy, please, spirit. Collective energy. Collective energy, please, spirit. Collective energy. So we got an eight of swords here. Somebody's in a in victim mentality. They're imprisoned. Or restricted in some way for coming after the things on the pathway of it looks like this main male they're guilty and there's gossip about it and they could have been very cheerful when they were doing it or the fact that they're bound now is cause for cheerfulness people are gossiping they're challenged they feel broken and shattered by this their body they're challenged by their body. I don't know if their body is broken. They're in poverty. And they need to weigh their options. Conversation. They're challenged by conversation. They need to weigh their options. They didn't gain the spiritual throne. They got a message of concern. They went and mend this connection. They neglected it. They made mistakes. They've been disconnected. They're re-evaluating their options. <clears throat> Child. So I don't know if there's a child involved. We got potential beginnings. <clears throat> there's no horse playing around. These people, their this community, their values were all about money. They're under adjudication. They can't mess around anymore. They, there's a no contact order. They can't have a conversation with this, with these individuals anymore. They may need to see a doctor. You're moving on to calmer waters. You're leaving behind this baggage. You're getting a house. This wise guy thinks that there's unfinished business and maybe there is within the courts for this wise guy who did not get a leadership role.
Way to work. Disagreeing with what's happening here with the main male. He's conscientious. He's a wealthy man coming into more unexpected income or vitality. Vitality. And he's a free spirit. Falseness in the reverse. So somebody's disagreeing, but it's what's happening here is the truth. There's no falseness here. So even though the wise guy is disagreeing and wishing that people understood how they feel, um, the truth is out. They did not, they're not at peace. They didn't get what they were expecting. They're in bad health because um, they weren't able to sabotage this star. This is a new chapter. This main male hasn't given up on the main female and him yet. He's still, he's still working for that. Oh, there might be a surprise. A big surprise because that's a 6,000 pound weight. So there could be a big surprise coming up. We've got the Four of Wands uh, reunion, freedom, marriage, self-love. You're still trying to heal and it was prophesied. And you got this mature man there hoping to bring... Yeah, he wants to offer a service. He's here in the in the environment. He wants to offer a service to these Four of Wands, to these um, reunions. But he's, his intention is to bring conflict and competition, some sort of tension or strife to these important gifts. It's too late to take any action, but he's still there um, hoping to get a position of service for these unions so that he can put in some um, conflict. <clears throat> yeah, he could be somebody's friend. The truth is out. The lovers are here. There's a child being remembered or a bloodline being remembered. There is a main female here um, gaining a new job. Old woman servant. We'll need to be clarifying that. And then we got young woman. Soldier, house, prison, foe. There's a younger woman who's a soldier. She's coming into the house. It could be this old woman who's masquerading herself as a younger woman to come in as a servant or something, but she's a soldier. And um, she's going to be going to prison. She's a foe. She's coming in to try to um, sabotage these reunions and their fortune, their gift. She's working with this mature man. Who's, who's also trying to provide a service of disrupting these, disrupting these unions. And that's what this old woman who is um, masquerading as a young woman, a young servant woman, is attempting to do here with these lovers. Collective energy, please, Spirit. Collective energy. You know, and they say that if you want to get the job done right, do it yourself. And this is just a prime example. You know, if you want somebody to come in and clean your house, you have the potentiality of having this shapeshifter come in. Right? And um, manipulating the energy of the space. Gathering information. It's a spy, basically. A servant spy. A soldier servant spy.
somebody wants to compromise, they're feeling restricted with this Eight of Swords. They were trying to take the things from this pathway that belongs to this main male. They're guilty. People are gossiping about it. There's a cheerfulness around this. They want to compromise. They did not triumph. They didn't triumph. They want to compromise. They're feeling broken. They're challenged because they're feeling broken. They're feeling shattered. They're challenged because their body is in a state of poverty. They want to negotiate. They want to have a conversation. Maybe they're challenged with having a conversation. It could be difficult to communicate at this point. They're frightened. They didn't get the spiritual throne. They're getting a message of concern about a child. They want to mend a connection. They are in a state of neglect. They neglected those around them. They made mistakes. They've been disconnected. They're reevaluating. Justice. Justice is being served. With power, with an ace of wands. Their values were all about money. They can't, there's a no contact order in the court system for this community. They can't horseplay around anymore with these individuals. They need to see the doctor. Preparations and arrangements are being made. There is unfinished business with this wise guy widower who is going after a leadership role. This relationship is ending. You're moving on into the house. You're moving into your house or you're moving into a new house or you're getting a new occupation within a house or some sort of a structure. They couldn't rob you. The wise guy wasn't able to rob you of a leadership position or your house or any of that. Your temple, any of that. And they were not able to cause you a loss. They're in, they're in disagreement. Um, they're all up in their feelings. They're like, I think you should consider how I feel when it's not about feelings. It's about what has occurred, right? You got a main male here who's conscientious, a wealthy man coming into more unexpected income. He's a free spirit, excited. Limitless potential. Falseness came out in the reverse. So there's no falseness here. He's not confined. He's gained his freedom. Whoever this main male is, he's gained his freedom. He has been released from some confinement. Star. He broke the bonds that had him ensnared. Certainly it's not just the feminines who are being drained of their vitality, you know, ensnared in, in contracts or agreements of some sort and then drained for their essence. So it's, I'm glad to hear that this main male who is true is not confined 
this wise guy um, is um, in disagreement. They didn't get the leadership role. They didn't get the spiritual throne. They tried to take this away from this main male. They, they had bound this main male, but he was able to break out of that. And justice is being served now. Yeah, there's a new chapter. This main male has not given up on his main female. There's a surprise, a big surprise, a 6,000 pound surprise. Woo, -hoo, big surprises are coming. Big surprises are coming. There's evidence about what um, this wise guy was doing. They're in bad health. They did not get what they were expecting. They're not at peace. There is um, an investigation going on. There's proof of everything. Yeah, they're not at peace because there's proof of everything. And your goal, so you've reached your goals. And you're coming into your blessing. Main male, main female. Stars. Main male, main female, stars. Coming into a four of wands, they're still trying to heal. They love themselves. It was prophesied. Freedom, again. Reunion, marriage. This mature man is there wanting to offer a service with the hope of causing conflict to these um, reunions. They want, to, um, they want to cause disappointment and loneliness, but there is a mercy and a kindness being shown here. Like, these people have allies now. Maybe they didn't before. Like, you know, these folks who do this kind of stuff, they like to pick the easy targets, the ones who don't have a support system, the ones who don't have a friends group, the ones who don't have anybody who can help bail them out of that. That's their easy target. They like that. And then they come at them with full force, right? It's not just one against one. It's hundreds against one. I know this because that was my experience in my, in my uh, battle. And other people know this too. When demons come for you, they don't come for you one on one. <laughs> hundreds. And not only that, they attach themselves to the people in the 3D and the physical, and then they come at you that way too. So it's... Daydream, illusion. Yeah, it's just a daydream. This mature man wanting to offer a service to these um, Four of Wands unions. They want to present themselves as a friend to somebody important. But they want to bring conflict to the to the union to the gift. It's it's too late to take any action. They're out of time, and it's all a daydream. It's just an illusion. So he's having a fantasy. He's stuck in a fantasy. The truth is out. The truth has been revealed, or the lovers are here, and perhaps, um, you know, the whole story isn't known. Perhaps um, there needs to be a conversation. There needs to be a remembrance. So this main female is getting a new occupation and you have this old woman here who's wanting to be a servant, but she's she's an old woman presenting herself as a young woman, ser a servant. So she's a shape, shapeshifter. Blind, awkward. self-love so the old woman servant can't see or the main female can't see that the old woman is actually a young woman who's a shape-shifting um, servant soldier to come and distort um, the reality using um, knowledge that they have gained to bring conflict. Yeah. It's their, they're collaborating with people. It's their profession. They want to bring conflict to your luck. They're strategizing against it. They want to make this main female sick. 
in the family unit. They want to mess with their mind and cause disturbances. So whoever this old woman is pretending to be a young woman's servant, um, yeah, she's a she's a um, slimy little shape shifting wench who, if she's even a female, <laughs> she may not even be a female. It with being a shapeshifter, you know, she's just presenting herself. She's just a shapeshifter, a shapeshifter. So you've got this mature man who wants to be of service. So, and then you've got an older woman, a mature woman who wants to be of service. They're wanting to infiltrate these unions as service people. We're going to do one more um, pass with this deck. Because I want to get a little more about this mature man and that old woman servant and what's happening with that. With the mature man, we see that it's a daydream. It's an illusion, and he doesn't have any time. He, it's too late to take any action. So he's got this fantasy that he wants to um, cause conflict um, for these people coming into this four of wands. But for him, it's a, it's a daydream. We need to find out a little bit more about this old woman presenting herself as a young woman servant to these lovers. Advers advers adversity. She wants to bring adversity. Worry. Yeah. Okay. So they're in a mental restriction or imprisoned. They did not triumph. They were coming after the things on the pathway of this main male. They want to compromise. They've been found guilty. People are gossiping about it. There's a cheerfulness regarding this. They're worried. It's like people are like happy that this thief has been caught. They're, they're frightened. They're feeling broken. Their body is in a state of poverty. They want to have a conversation. They want to negotiate. Balance. They're challenged by balance. They came after the spiritual throne of an innocent person. They want to mend this connection. They made mistakes. They neglected this person. They've been disconnected from this person. And justice is being delivered. Empathy. I am open to seeing both sides of a situation. So both sides of a situation are being looked at. Not everybody's freaking cruel, you know? Some people have been brutalized so badly that they would not like to see that in the world. Some people have been brutalized so badly that that's all they want to see in the world. Or that's all they see. It's a choice, isn't it? This mindset that we decide to live in oftentimes it's not a choice but when when the dust settles it becomes a choice peace new opportunities potential beginnings peace this community is under judication Preparations are being made. They can no longer horseplay around with this. Their values were all about money. The, there is a no contact order within the court system. They need to go see a doctor. You're moving on to calmer waters. You're leaving this baggage behind. This wise guy was not able to gain a leadership role. He is a widower. 
he feels there's unfinished business or maybe there is unfinished business. He was not able to rob you and he was not able to cause a loss for you. You are moving into your house, your new house, your new position within the kingdom, your spiritual throne. They were not able to take that from you, main male. You're not confined anymore. You're not false. You were never lying. Change. There's a change here. They were not able to rob you. They're all up in their feelings, but this has nothing to do with feelings. They're in grief. You've reached your goals. You've gained your blessing, your spiritual fortune star. You're coming into a new chapter. You have hope for um, for the reciprocal um, equal give and take partnerships. There is a surprise. This wise guy is not at peace. They didn't get what they were expecting. They're in bad health. There's an investigation and there's evidence of what they did. They're in grief because this main male was able to free himself and he's been found to be true. He's been found to be true blue. He's not whatever these people tried to paint him out to be. He's a friend. He's a friend. I wonder if this wise guy is a friend who turned on him trying to get his gift. Well, whatever it is, this main male is a friend. He's reached his goals. He's getting his blessing. And there is a new chapter. And there's hope for this partnership with his main female. You've got um, this main mature man who wanted to bring a surprise to this unions. He wants to cause loneliness. But there is charity. There's mercy um, for this main female still trying to heal. It's prophesied. Self-esteem. She possessed gift of the soul that benefit her and others. And she's, she's given aid. This mature man, it's all a fantasy. It's an illusion. His thoughts of bringing competition and um, conflict to this Four of Wands union. These important unions that are, uh, that are a gift to the world. They're presenting, they want to present themselves as a friend, but it's too late to take any action. It's just a fantasy. It's just a fantasy. Geez, don't can't they come up with any other dreams than that? Is that the is that the extent of their creator ability to dream up ways to destroy another human being? That's that's all they have to to that's the only thought power that they have to offer this collective. Yeah, they want the abundance. They're daydreaming about the abundance of those who actually do the work. See, there's those who create ways to overcome challenges. And then there's, there are those who create ways to present challenges. And those who present challenges never do the work to overcome challenges. So they never gain the merit for the reward that is earned by overcoming challenges. They're a thief and they force others to overcome challenges. They drive them to succeed. And then in the end, they come in and they try to snatch that gift, that reward. That's been the way of it. That's been the way of it. Imagination in the reverse. So this old woman is using her imagination in the reverse. She's presenting herself as a young woman servant in the home of this main female who could be blind or unaware. Yeah, this person is envious of this main female. She needs to get the hell out of that house. Main female needs to wash her own damn dishes. This old woman needs to surrender her need to control and she's facing a death. She 
She's in fear of these relationships that serve the higher good. So she, so she planted herself right in the household of one to try to um, destroy it. And she's probably going to be destroyed. She's misusing her imagination to try to sabotage somebody else's life. Rather than use her imagination to uplift her own world, she's using her imagination to tear down somebody else's life. There's nothing of value there. Fifty six minutes. I'm going to go ahead and shut this one off, everybody. Um, I'm going to pull. No, I'm not. I'm going to pull this because I want to see a little bit more about that old woman. I want to see what's happening there. So we know that it's the imagination is in the reverse. So she's using her imagination in a dark way. She's an old woman, but she's presenting herself as a young woman servant to these lovers. Blind. Somebody's blind. So there's a veil. She's there is a a cloak. The truth is being revealed. The truth will be revealed. Needs. She has needs. What else about this old woman presenting herself as a young woman, this shapeshifter? Presenting herself as a servant to these lovers? Broken. Broken. They didn't keep the promises they made. And they may break your heart, but not your spirit. They're feeling broken. They broke the promises they made. They broke your heart. And they're shape-shifting into another form to come here and do it again. You may feel that you're fighting this situation alone. You may feel that um, others are distant from you but this is ending this is ending okay and on that note i will turn this one off and i'll see you on the next one everybody bye